Hey what's up guys this is Wasi from FlameLineVisualEffects.com and welcome back to my another brand new After Effects tutorial. In this tutorial we will learn how to create 3D trendy logo animation inside of Adobe After Effects so let's see what we will create today. This video is sponsored by Mixkit. Mixkit is a free website for online video creators. You will find here tons of free assets like stock video, stock music, sound effects, video templates and lots more. All assets are 100% copyright free and no attributes or sign up required to use or download Mixkit assets. Click the link in the description box below to visit Mixkit and download free assets today. Can I get 500 likes for this tutorial? If yes, please hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe my channel. Ok, so let's get started. Ok, so first create a new composition and let's call it logo animation and uh, I'm going with 192080p frame rate 29.97 and duration make it 6 seconds long then go to 3d render and then render set it cinema 4d then click on ok ok now import your logo you need to convert your logo to shape layer if you have any vector format of your logo then simply import it and convert it to shape layer or if you don't have any vector format of your logo then simply follow these steps to convert your logo into shape layer. Okay, so import your logo. Then place it into this timeline. Now select this layer, then go to layer, then click on auto trace. Then channel set it alpha, then click on OK. Now select this layer, then press M on your keyboard, then select all keyframes, then press Ctrl plus C and make sure you check how many uh, marks created. In my case total 8 marks created. Ok now create a new shape layer, so right click new then click on shape layer. Now click on add then click on path. As you can see total 8 marks created so create total 8 path by pressing ctrl plus D. Now open uh, every path. And set a keyframe. Then simply select all keyframes then press ctrl plus V. Now click on add, then click on fill. Now you can delete this layer and rename it this layer to logo. Okay, let's change the color. You can choose any color you want. Now select this layer and make it 3D by clicking here. Then select this layer and press Ctrl plus D twice. Now select this two layer and change the color to white. Now select this third layer. Then go to geometric option. Then extrusion depth set it uh, maybe 160. Perfect. Now go to top view. And then select this logo to layer and change the position a little bit. Then select logo 3 and change the position to something like this.
now go to active camera perfect okay now create a new null object so right click new then click on null object make this null object 3d now select these three layers and parent it to null one okay let's create our uh, background so go to toolbar and select ellipse tool then create a circle and change the anchor point to the center make this layer center now change the color now select this layer and rename it to bg then press S on your keyboard then set a keyframe on scale then scale amount set it 0 then go forward few seconds and increase the scale amount very high something like this now select these two keyframe and press F9 to make them easy ease then open graph editor and then change the graph curve something like this now select this layer and place it below all the layers okay looks good to me now go to beginning of this animation now select known one layer then press s then hold down shift then press r now set a keyframe on scale and set a keyframe on x and y rotation now scale amount set it zero then go to around two seconds then increase the scale amount And then X rotation set it minus 35 and Y rotation set it minus 350 then go forward few seconds then Y rota X rotation set it 0 and then Y rotation set it minus one and decrease the scale amount perfect now select all keyframes then press f9 to make them easy ease then open graph editor then change the graph curve Okay, let's ramp view it looks good to me okay now create a new text layer so right click new then click on text then type your text I type in mix kit now change the position now select this layer then press P then hold down shift and then press T then set a keyframe then go backward few frames then change the position and opacity set it 0 
then select these two keyframe and press F9 to make them easy ease then open graph editor and then change the graph curve looks good to me okay let's import our uh, project files you can download these project files from link in the description box below okay so first uh, select element 1 layer and then place it into this timeline then select element 2 and place it into this timeline then select element 3 and add to this timeline and move it forward something like this okay let's ramp view it perfect looks good to me our animation is complete thank you very much for watching this tutorial have a great day and don't forget to check mixkit link in the description box below